welcome to today's vlog. So we are starting over at the Thai, well Thai, not Thai, like a play centre today which is called Round the Twist. We've been here quite a few times, especially with Aurora, but we've come with Aurora and my little tiny nephew. So we brought them here to play today. Obviously for legal reasons we can't vlog him, which is such a shame. Hopefully not for much longer. But anyway, Aurora is just in this little play area, a bit over here. So you can just see a little head there. Anyway, we went over to Sue's this morning and picked up the other car. So we've been looking for car insurance. We seem to have found something. It's not the cheapest, but it's going to do. And well, it is cheap really because the thing is, the thing is with this, you've got to have a box on it, so you can only do so many miles a year, which is like four thousand. But we don't do that anyway. Even if we go to Blackpool and Wales, all the way through the six weeks holidays, and we don't do that in a year, so that's just going to be awesome for us because the cars are more or less going to be sat around and only going out on weekends and stuff like that. So it's coming back at a real good price. I think it was like four hundred and something, and you had to pay maybe five hundred and something. You had to pay three hundred, three hundred and something up front, and then it was like seventeen pound a month. So we'll probably just pay that up all together. So we're not going to be getting that till. October because it's still insured from Sue's insurance till October so I'm just driving it because obviously I'm full of comp so I'm insured third party fire and theft to drive any other car which is great because she could just keep hers insured and we don't have to worry about it till October and we can get the money together and stuff like that but yeah anyway I'm gonna go over here with Aurora because she's looking like a little lost soul and take baby over there and just yeah, enjoy the morning. Yay, what you got? Do you want me to put it in the buggy for you? What do you want me to do? Don't be annoying her. Do you want me to move it? Yeah. Do you want me to take it out? Yeah? yeah? Oh, one minute. Are you putting it in the rocky chair? Hey? Good girl. Oh, rock the baba to sleep. Rock the baba to sleep. Woo! Woo! He's so too good. He's so too good. I don't know what she's doing now. Wait. Oh, are you in the house? Hey, she's in her element here. I don't know. It's all been done up here now. So we've got the post office, we've got the supermarket, and we've got a house. Haven't we? Hey, and she's got a, a ha Oops! Oops! <laughs> That's for your high chair, that. Yeah, this goes here. Look. I want to put it on for you. Watch. There you go. Wow, this is a really good house, isn't it? We need one of these building. She needs a bag. Why are you taking her to school? What you can do your ironing. Look, and you can do your washing. You got your washing up liquid. You've got all your food. Yeah. That's your Hoover. This is a car seat. I'm not too sure what this is. Oh, this is not a car seat thing. I'm going to put the handle on. I'm not sure how it goes on, like. Oh, have you got butter? Yeah. Yeah, so you can make some toast. There's no point putting it on the ironing board. You don't cook your food on the ironing board. Oh, you've got lots of stuff in here, too. I'm fine. Look, we've got another kitchen in there. Oh, we've got some baby toys in here as well. Which is good. You want the shopping trolley? Move out of the way and then let me get it for you. This one. Whoa. This is one you want in it for Christmas. What? Hello. 
Oh, look, why don't you put your baby here? Oh, and you can feed her. Yeah. yeah. Let's move that into there because you don't want a car seat yet. Yeah. yeah, and you can go shopping. And she's got a bed here, hasn't she, as well? Yeah. Oh, you're covering her up. Oh. What are you going to go shopping for? What are you going to get? Oh, look, you've got visitors. Should we let them in? Bye. Hey? <laughs> Say, you coming in? Say, come in, stop knocking on. Yeah, I'll put your shopping trolley here. Yeah? yeah. It's cool, this, isn't it? <laughs> Build one of these in the garden with a proper roof on it. Hello! Should we go and show the guys everything else? Yes. Look, we've got the post office. Whoa, where's the <laughs> Whoa, can you go right through? <laughs> and we've got the post box here. Gina. Can you go through again? <laughs> oh, she's in the post office now, doing some work. <laughs> Oscar, you going round the side? Oh, you've not been to the play centre for so long, have you? <laughs> Blippi. What does Blippi do? Yeah, you do. You did it on the side before. Tell everyone to be a monkey. You've got to get everyone to be a monkey with you. That'll do it. Dad likes acting stupid. Get everyone in here to be a monkey with you. Oh, yeah. <laughs> like Blippi. Right. <laughs> He's laughing again. Is it? <laughs> I know, I don't blame him. <laughs> Oscar, she might not want to go on it, son. She's in her element with her house, isn't she, babe? Yeah, she just loves playing babies, doesn't she? Whoa! You can go that way anyway and climb up. Follow Oscar. Come on, go up with Oscar and you can go on the side. No. Unless you hold it. Come on, my guy. Help me into the Oscar. Sit on my knee. Bye bye. Say bye, Posh. Bye, Posh. Wow. I'm coming. Go. Not a chance was I going down that side. For some reason, when you go down it and it turns, like on a real sharp bend, it's just, it's not, it's not nice. It's really not nice. Anyway, we're gonna have a drink of water. And then I think we've got like 25 minutes left. So, baby's gone to sleep. He's, he's zapped out now enjoyed himself that much he's been on the slide he's been playing in the that house with Aurora he's been in the post office he's been playing on the floor it's just yeah the only downside to everything in this place is that there's no batteries in anything so nothing works not a single tie which obviously isn't good but anyway we've still made it fun 
so I'll go. But Aurora is obsessed now with this and going down this killer wheel, wheel slide. She's just up and down and up and down and up and down. You're so big now! <laughs> anyway, I'm gonna love you and leave you. I'm checking soon. Got some bloods over at the hospital today. I'm gonna do what I need to do. Probably take Porsche to get some bits for school because she's back from school tomorrow. And maybe Oscar as well. And then, really don't know where we're going from there. We were gonna go home, but it just seems pointless because Dave's almost near school. So if he goes that way, then he's got to go all the way back that way. And it's just, I don't know. We might try and find a park, go to the park half an hour. Maybe that is the best option for both of us. And then, yeah. Are you feeding your baby? Oh, she got a bib on. What, is she having yogurt? Does she like it? Oh, we'll clean that in a minute. Oh, dripping. She's so funny. Eat it all, don't make a mess. <laughs> oh, daddy's getting in practice. <laughs> oh, is that yum yum? Okay, guys, I thought that I would check in because I do apologize. It's been a bit of a crazy day today. So we took, obviously, the babies out this morning. But before we went and picked, obviously, Davina's son up, or my nephew, um, we went and picked the car up. So as you can see, I don't know if you'll be able to see, we do have a second car now. So we went and picked that up first. Then we went and got met Carl and got Riker Jacks. And then, then obviously we went to the ball place. We were in there for a bit, but it's just been crazy since then. I had to be at the hospital for 10 to 4. So obviously, like I was saying in the ball place, Dave has to go to school and I needed to go to the hospital. But by the time we got out there, it was like 2 o'clock. So we kind of, I had to kill two hours and Dave would have been okay because by the time he would have got to school, it would have been like half two. So he would have only been waiting like 25 minutes. But I got to the hospital around three o'clock and I thought, oh, do you know what? I'm not gonna sit here. I'm just gonna go in and see if we can get seen earlier. My appointment was at 10 to four. So I got in there at like, probably just gone three o'clock and I said, I've got an appointment of 10 to four, I know I'm earlier, but you know, because I'm only having blood to donate, if there's any space and just fit me in as and when you can, because it was just like a walking appointment anyway. Um, but he said just come around 10 to 4 just because that's probably when they won't be as busy so anyway got in there and he said oh well we should be able to see you sooner because it's not that busy anyway it didn't end up getting seen till 10 to 4 anyway but i suppose it was better going in at 3 and getting seen at 10 to 4 than going in at 10 to 4 and waiting till 10 to 5 so yes it was a little bit crazy this afternoon so anyway I ended up getting home around, by the time I dropped baby off and got home, it was around half five. So, anyway, I'm just going to give you a little rundown. You're probably sat there thinking, we you tell them you've been to the doctors for blood test, but you're not telling us what it's for. So, I mention this all the time when I'm pregnant, I get antibodies, which is called anti E. And obviously that's been picked up in my pregnancy again. So, they have to do like routine blood checks every week. Usually don't get it this early in pregnancy which to me is quite worrying again, obviously, but I should imagine I should be okay now. Um, well, this time, because I think with me being on all, I'm on anti, sorry, I'm on vitamin D, vitamin C, folic acid, and my iron tablet. So I'm getting plenty of vitamins and that should be all good. So hopefully it won't be too much to worry about they just monitor it to make sure it's not so when they did the other blood two weeks ago they'll do one now and then they'll see if it's risen and then they probably won't do another one until i go and have my next scan and then they'll do that and they'll see how much that one's risen and then they'll probably say right stable down now so we probably won't do 
another one for another like four weeks or something so I'll probably do one like every four weeks depending on whether they feel that it's necessary to do another one or they might just call me in and say we won't do um, a check on the antibodies just to make sure everything is okay so usually it's nothing to worry about it can be dangerous in pregnancy if it's not caught early enough or I'm not too sure how it works with the antibodies so if it, they rise then it's dangerous but if they're kind of leveled to a certain height then usually everything is just fine and touch wood I've never really had any issues with the anti yeast so with a bit of luck baby looks healthy perfect growing so I don't think it's affecting baby in any way which is a good sign so yeah anyway we went for some blood so hopefully they should be back in the next couple of days and then I'll have a rough idea of when they're going to be doing like regular blood checks whether it's going to be every week or once every month and stuff like that and then my other blood test should come back hopefully or I should imagine I will hear from like the Down syndrome and you get your percentage don't you like blow up was a crash then my heart went um you get your percentage back don't you and it says whether you like high risk or low risk so i should imagine i'll have that soon but apart from that i think everything else should be fine apart from me iron deficiency which i'm thinking that's come back okay because i'm sure that if it hadn't they would have asked for a repeat also on that unless she has done that because she did take two lots of blood so i'm wondering whether she did do both of them i'm not too sure but anyway, yeah, so I got home, got into something comfy because I had the jumper on and I was absolutely roasting. Because when we went out this morning, it was nice and cool. And then when I got to the hospital this afternoon, it was like blazing sun and I was sweating buckets. So I just thought, no, I'm getting, get my boots off, get my shorts on, get a nice baggy t-shirt on. That is how we love to feel when we're pregnant, in it? Just really comfy and I hate my bump being covered at the minute so who is this oh she's bringing my child have you had a bath she's going back to school tomorrow <laughs> are you going back to school tomorrow are you excited hey are you going to see abby uh, at nursery get your wet head off me yeah are you going to see abby at nursery <gasps> Where did we go today? Did you come to the hospital with Mama? Mm, hey, yeah. where are we going to see the baby? <laughs> That's where you was. That's the hospital where you came out, Mummy's mm, tummy. No. Hey, that's mm, where all the nurses that looked after you while you was in my tummy. <laughs> I know. Yes, Mummy has to get your dress first. Hey, right. Mum. Dress. You want to get dressed? Yeah. Mm, okay, let's go and get dressed then. Help me. Help me. Help me. Help me. She's all dressed for bed now and she wants my orange juice, don't you? Yeah. Do you want my orange juice? Yeah. Okay, say please then. <laughs> say please? No. Okay, I'm not getting my orange juice then. <laughs> say please and I will get it. Do you want my orange juice? You want my orange juice? Mm. What do you say if you want something of mummy's? Mm. You have to say please mummy. No. Okay, no orange. No orange, I'll sit down then. No. Do you want some? Yeah. What do you say? Do you say please mama? Please mama. <laughs> <laughs> Say please, Mama. Right, I'm not your friend because you're usually really, really polite and say please, Mama. Oh, is it because you're tired? Hey, no excuse, lady. No excuse. Do you want this? What do you say? <laughs> you're not having none of it, are you? Okay, then. If you give it your, what do you say? What do you say? Thank you, Mummy. <laughs> oh, is that yummy? Are you just thirsty? You've done nothing but drink all day. Have you? 
She's been playing with this. Bit more. Playing, aren't you? Of oh, Alfie's. Oh. This is the new favourite toy. And then we were playing downstairs. You were helping when we do the washing, weren't you? Well, I put all the... I put all the washing on the radiator to dry and somebody took it off the radiator and put it under the cot. Didn't they? Did you put it under the cot? Mm. Eh? Mm. Why? It was wet. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's yeah, the cot. Did you have a fun day today? With Riker? I can see your eyes. Mm. <laughs> Did you have a fun day today with Riker? Mm. Hey, you're getting that all down, you've just had a bath. Can you clean it? Yeah, I'll clean you. Are you excited to go back to nursery tomorrow? Mm. Hey. Mm, my shoes and I'm drying my clothes. Yeah, hey. but no, give me that one now, you can have this orange. That one can go in the fridge, right? Because it's too late to have that bob now, right? She's so cheeky. I just thought we'd, um, Admirer, you know, drinking out of a glass so people know that she does drink from a glass. Yes, because everybody seems to think that you have a bottle all the time. Well, not not everybody, just one particular person. Eh? Yeah. All gone? Yeah. All right. Are we going to have a bit of a snack before bed? Eh, some supper? Anyway, say goodnight to everybody because you'll be going to bed soon. Say goodnight, tell them you'll see him tomorrow and you'll tell them how your first day at nursery again was. It's not your first day at nursery, but first day back after your holidays, isn't it? You've had a long time off nursery, haven't you? <coughs> oh, excuse you. <laughs> <laughs> right, say goodnight to everybody. Oh, the guys are going to be upset if you don't say bye-bye to him. Say night, guys. Night guys. Night. <laughs> Good night to everybody. Oh, do you want to show them your teddy you've been playing with actually? Yeah. This. Show them this. What does it do? Press What else can you press? That's my I love you. You can press the hands. That's green hand. It's got a green hand. What colour is the other hand? Purple. Good girl. What about the ear? If you're happy and you know it, I have oh, two ears. Let's, hey, come on and count on the pink ear. I have two ears. Let's count. Let's see if we can get to do. Bake me a cake as fast as you can. How I wonder what you are. If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. If you're happy and you know it, and you really want to show it. If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. That's my heart. Oh, I think he wants a cuddle. Where's my blue Oh. Say good night to the guys. Tell your Teddy to say good night. Tell your Teddy. No, can't get my words out. Tell your Teddy to say na nights. <laughs> say na nights. Watch. Watch Bear say na nights. Oh, you're going to hurt her. You're just being silly. All right. Night, guys. So, how was your first day back at school? What's your new teacher like? Good. Do you yeah. like her? Yeah. That's all that matters then. So, what did you do today? Um, I did some work. First, I played out, but we didn't have no snacks yet. And then we had a, and then we had a little drawing. And then we played out, and we had our snacks. Mm -hmm. um, and then we did some homework. Homework. In, yeah. in school. Yeah. <laughs> homework. Homework. Some more homework, and then do some more drawing, and then. Play out for a bit and then yeah. What did you have for your dinner? Later wrap. Did you? Tuna wrap and some salad. Mm hmm. And a brownie. Did 
Did you? Mm, that sounds delicious. So, 10 out of 10. Good day back. Yeah. Gonna play out five more minutes and go in bed then, aren't you? Well, gonna get I'm ready for bed. I'm in year two. And Aurora's thinking that cat's here over there with a little plastic bowl. <laughs> One minute. I don't think so. She's got a habit of having a yogurt and thinking she can put it in everything. I'm going out. <laughs> You're not putting your yogurt in there. Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah. Uh. What, baby girl? Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. What is it? Oh, a game. Ice creams. Ice creams. Can you match them? Hey. Yes. Okay, so it was Chloe's birthday yesterday, so I'm just going to show you her cards because we didn't vlog very much yesterday and there wasn't enough to put a vlog together for today. So, we already had a video for tonight, so it kind of gave us a bit of a, well, we don't really need to vlog anything. Even though we could have still vlogged and saved it, but to be fair, Chloe wasn't here most of the day anyway. By the time we've given her a card, she'd literally gone out the door, so we didn't see her all day. Then she was out with friends and then out with a boyfriend, so yeah. She had a lovely day, that's all that matters. And yeah, I'm just going to show you the card she got. She got this one off Imogen, which is just adorable, just quickly. Dave bought me this plant the other day, which is so nice and... Yeah, I think it's real. <laughs> Portia said, is that real? Well, it is real. It's um, an aloe vera plant, which is just nice. I need to put some water in it. So, she got this one off Imogen. This is off me and Dave. This one is off the kids. And then this one is off a dad. And then this one is off a boyfriend. So, yeah. I feel like you've got cards missing. Do you not feel like somebody's cards missing? And then she got flowers. These are beautiful. Off Curtis. Um of Chloe. And then who are these ones off Chloe? Abby. Which are so pretty as well. I'm gonna take these out of the packet in a bit for you and put them in that vase. <laughs> but they're so pretty. The colours are gorgeous on these, aren't they? They remind me of a Mom. wedding bouquet, these. Mom. Don't you think? Mom. Real Mom. pretty, aren't they? Mom. Yes. Mom. Yes. Has it gone off? Because you've been pressing it. It's falling down. Has it? You've just got yogurt all over the couch. Nice. This is what real life is like, if you want to know. This is what parents have to do when the children have a yogurt. Mmm. Okay, guys. It is the day after. I was going to say the morning after. Well, it is kind of morning afternoonish but i did do a part of this vlog yesterday where i was showing you some ribbons but for some reason the memory card just didn't save the last part that i did so i'm just going to show you them again quickly now although you'll probably see them again in tomorrow's vlog what are you doing <laughs> um so we got this one and i'd also messed up because i said we got them off it so i didn't get them off it so i got them from alibaba i mean they take like four weeks to come in fact, were these about three weeks? I do the outros. These were about three weeks, you don't anymore. Um, it's not even been editing the vlogs, I've been doing it. So all the credit to me, you know, if you're enjoying them. <laughs> um, but anyway, so we got this ribbon, which is just, let me see if it'll zoom in. God, I do apologise if it's rocky, but it's on top of a fire. Um, so this one's just got like drips of like the top of a cupcake kind of look with little can't remember it's gone and we also got this one it's done me adding that it didn't record yesterday because i was showing penelope and she just really liked her and she was asking me to make her some socks um but yeah anyway this is it it's got unicorns on and the colors in these are amazing i was expecting them to come not as good a quality as they actual actually have just I think it's it's not because I've bought them from Alibaba from AliExpress. I don't know if I said that AliExpress in the first place. Um, it's just because obviously I've not ordered from there before, and to be fair, anything that I have ordered, I can't complain about. It is really really good and it is really really cheap. So if anybody is looking to buy anything, even if it's for a party or just anything for your kids. 
even to do your own bowls or you know just decoration for birthday parties christmas anything just definitely um check them out but make sure you do order in advance because most stuff does take like three to four weeks um minimum so and some things can take longer so yeah but these are the ribbons so i think this one is 38 or 36 mil and then this one is 25 if i remember correctly i will double check and i will tell you in tomorrow's vlog sorry just run out of space um as i was saying we are trying to do our best on trying to get some up every single day unfortunately come maybe i'm not too sure what's going to be happening so as of october once i know more we will be scheduling vlogs they probably won't be on the days that we've been vlogging just because we're going to be having something going on which is preparing to be in a um you know for hopefully going back home and that's just going to take around three to four months so um it's just got, it's just going to be hard so we're going to have to try and like work out how to still make a vlog interesting even if we've got to catch kind of try and double vlog in a day so we've got like backup vlogs and stuff but anyway we'll let you know nearer to the time because it might not even come to that yet um but we're just you know making you aware now that we are we are preparing now just so we have got vlogs for that period of time or just so we don't like fall behind and then end up being in the situation that we usually end up being in where we just like don't vlog so but anyway like i said keep it up today i'm gonna love you leave you and i hope you all have a fantastic day evening morning whatever time it is you're checking in and we will see you guys tomorrow